Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to save on gas fees when you're doing stuff on Binance Smart Chain. So I didn't figure this out, I just pieced it together from uh, some things that a couple of other people have posted online. Um, I can't take credit for this. So let's, let me just think, because I haven't really, I've not prepared slides or anything, I'm just going to try and go through the process so you can follow along. So you can see how simple it is, hopefully. So MetaMask, right, is normally, for me, it's normally connected to Binance Smart Chain. So what you want to do is add a new network like this um, in the network setting. And this works on mobile as well. It just looks slightly different. The um, I can't remember what the difference is. I think it's virtually the same on mobile, on the mobile app. So add a new network, but you're gonna you're not gonna add one from this list here, you're gonna add one manually like this. Network name doesn't matter as long as this is just for your own reference. I'm gonna call it Oops Oh Binance Smart Chain. In brackets I'm gonna put pocked. Now pocked is um pocket network. That's all I know. Don't ask me what it means. I'm going to have a clue. And usually you would put um, the Binance RPC URL. RPC is the um, remote remote I can't remember. It doesn't matter. You don't need to know what that is even. Um, you're going to paste no, not that in. That's the wallet address. Um, right, just a second, I'll go and find it. Okay, I'm back. Delete that. Right, the one, I'm going to put it in the description for the video, it's that. Have a quick look at it, BSC mainnet, gateway, pocked network, blah, 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 blah. It's the same, the rest of it's all the same config settings as for Binance Smart Chain. So it's chain ID 56 and the currency symbol is BNB and the block URL Block Explorer is BSC scan, so it's HTTPS colon slash slash BSC C scan scan dot com. I always have difficulty typing that. I think the letters are just too close on the keyboard. Um, I forgot to say, I you can't just edit your existing Binance Smart Chain config. You need to add a new one, a new network. And it's better because if this one stops working at any point, you want to be able to switch back to the the original BSC one. So that's done. And now if I go to my Furio. So the reason for this, for this change, the reason this came about, this information, is because when you claim and sell, when you, sorry, when you sell Furio, the gas fee has gone up really significantly. And it's because the it's because the um, the actual process involved is now much more complex because of it sending part of the part of the um, the value rather than you getting a hundred percent in USDC when you sell you get only get seventy five percent and the other twenty five goes to the fuel pool so it's a much more complex transaction. On the blockchain, and that's why the the much higher gas fee. So that's why people have figured out about using this. I think it was Crypto Stew. Thanks, Crypto Stew. Awesome. Um, who suggested making this change? So now, if I want to compound this, the thing that I keep forgetting to do, I've set this up for loads of my wallets, but I keep forgetting it. It's just routine. I just automatically scroll down and hit confirm for the gas fee. But what you have to do is when the the gas box pops up, you want to click edit. You can ignore that. Well, I'll just show you that again. It's just saying the gas fee has been suggested by Furio. If you change it, it might have problems, right? Yeah, I'm going to edit it and change it to one because it was five before save confirm and it 
it usually takes a little bit longer than it did on the original BSC or PC. Eventually, we're all just going to speak in in um, abbreviations, aren't we? So as you can see, it's taking a little while. On some occasions, I've had it where it just timed out completely. Just try again, if that happens. Because this is going to reduce your gas fees to a fifth. It's going to reduce them fantastically. So, um, you know, if you're doing a lot of compounding transactions, it's going to save you a significant amount on the gas fees. I've been burning through so much gas recently, it's just staggering. And I'm really pleased that I've got this option now to to make my gas my gas money last a lot longer. Although, it's now a question of time. How much is my time worth? There we go, it's completed. So what I'm going to do now is just show you... Grab that wallet address and show you on BSC scan. I should be able to show you. There's yesterday's compound. Well, it was actually the day before by the looks of it. Let's see what that was. Oops. It was 34 cents. Okay. That's definitely that one. Yeah, compound. 34 cents. Now let's have a look at this one from 34 seconds ago. Five cents. That's incredible, isn't it? Wow. That's that's it. That's all there is to it. Just add that network and make sure you your uh, MetaMask is set to use that network. And remember to change the gas fee because a number of times I've forgotten to change it. Then go, ah oh, man. So, okay. Thanks for watching. Any questions, stick them in the comments. If you liked it, leave a comment, hit the like button, subscribe, whatever. Please yourself. I don't mind. Over and out.